they might not use words but that doesn't mean babies aren't trying to tell us something here is how to listen to your little one he lets you know when he is hungry and when he had enough to eat he tells you how he prefers to be held and how much he likes or doesn't like to be rocked as he drifts off to sleep you get to know the ups and downs of his day his favorite toys and soon the best picture in his board book he shows you who his favorite people are that would be you baby pa here are the important things that your baby is trying to tell you Babies need gentle loving responses from their parents. When a newborn cries, it's a strong signal or cue. I need to be comforted. I need to be held. I need you. It's important to respond in a timely manner to relieve her distress and calm her. Making sense of your baby's communication comes with watching your baby. From the beginning, be a really keen observer in a quiet calm way. Just watch how your baby behaves. As the relationship grows, you will get to know her better. You will start to learn what her little facial expressions and body movements mean. As time goes on, the unpredictability of the newborn stage gradually gives way to patterns. You will come to know that after feeding and burping, your baby likes some time on your shoulder to digest. Through all the little rituals of the day, the diapering and feeding and rocking his needs and likes and dislikes will be clearer to you. You will identify some of his different cries and facial expressions. Something marvelous is happening. As you begin to understand your baby, your baby begins to understand you. As you respond to her, rub her back to calm her or tickle her feet when she is playful. She comes to know that you are there for her, that you love her and will protect her. She is learning to trust you.